everybody, this is Train 1102, and I just wanted to say I took all the hair out of my Zinni kit because I didn't like the fact that the hair was too coarse, it was all different sizes. I decided because I was impatient and with the Irene hurricane that we just had in New York, I just was very, very impatient. I am supposed I was supposed to have ruby red hair for Sam, but what happened was that's my Zenny kit. That was done by Pam's Reborn Nursery. I, please do not order from her. She is not a good reborn artist. Um it took her a month to finish my reborn and she was working two jobs. The communication was horrible. I I didn't hear from her. She was playing games with me. She wasn't answering her phone. She wasn't answering her cell phone. She wasn't answering her email. She wasn't answering her Facebook. And I just got to the point where I was very, very upset and very frustrated and I just didn't know what to do anymore. So I said I wanted my reborn back and when I got my reborn, there her hair was not rooted. The, it, the hair looked like it was put on by a pencil, but then I, when I tried to wash it off and erase it with a pencil, there was none. It was actually um, done with like a fine like marker or something like that, like some kind of like tip, felt tip or whatever, pencil or something, I mean pen or something. Um, also, um, what else? Um, her magnet came out of her head. I don't know how that happened. I guess. It was not glued on correctly like it was supposed to be. She probably used hardly any glue. Or maybe it just popped out because maybe when I went to go and and try to go and look inside the head to, I don't know what I was doing. I don't even remember. All I know is I don't know why it popped out. I guess I was, I know I was cleaning the inside of the head, that's what I was doing, with the, because there was hair inside the head and I wanted to clean it out so I could get all ready for when the mohair comes. I bought dark brown um, mohair and that's what I'm going to ro root Zinni with. And then I'm going to root Ladybug because I bought the Ladybug kit. I'm going to root her with ruby red hair that I got from this woman. She had a death in the family, so I have to wait for her to send it to me. Plus, I also ordered um, either ash blonde or ash brown hair, and I'm going to root blinking with that because that's what I bought the blinking kit. And she said it should be there here at my house Thursday and Friday. I'm very really excited. It cost me a lot of money to get everything. All the items that I bought, plus the kit, Plus shipping, it came out to like $253. A lot of money, but it was worth it. And then I also got a, um, what's it called? I also got a, what was that called? I also got a kit, I'm not a kit, a, um, a halogen oven which I paid $74 for in free shipping. It was the cheapest one, and it came with the extender ring that gets, that puts it to a little bit, I think it puts it to like 15, like w the diameter, I guess, around it. Um, so that's about 15 li liter, that's what it said, yeah. Um, I looked for a cheaper one. A lot of people said they paid $35. I couldn't find any $35 ones, so... It's okay. I got a nice one. It's a nice oven. It's it's a halogen oven. It's nice and it, and I'm hoping that, you know, and I put it in for you put the reborns in for 4 minutes each. And um 4 minutes to like I think it's like I think it's like 4 I think it's like 8 minutes for like for like between the head and the legs. I'm not sure. I have to go look online and find out what to do. I'm looking at tutorials, I'm looking at a whole bunch of stuff, so as soon as I look at everything and look at all the tutorials and see what to do, I mean, uh, I've been looking at some Bountiful Baby tutorials, I've been looking at Beautiful Baby tutorials, uh, there's this one woman, she has a whole site on how to make babies reborn through trial and error, so I'm looking at that, it's, I think it's beautifulbaby.com or something like that, I think it is. Uh, learn how to reborn the beautiful baby way. It's, um, she's Nicole J. Russell, and it's www.beautifulbabydolls.com. Yeah, again, it's www.beautifulbabydolls.com, and the, she tells you how to make reborns her way, 
or by trial and error. So I'm looking forward to that. I'm really, really looking forward to learning how to be a Reborn artist because I definitely want to sell them. The reason why I want to sell Reborn dolls are not to make money for, um, for just to make money. The reason why I want to make Reborn dolls is I feel that I have a connection to Reborn dolls like everybody else does and I feel that Reborns are a part of me. And what I want to do is I want to be able to make Reborns for people who can't afford $300 and up. Um, my Reborns, if I'm good and I succeed at this, which I'm giving myself 100% courage and emotional support by my fa friends and family, thank you so much, everybody, including Laura. Thank you so much. You're the reason why I've started to Reborn, because your support and your encouragement and the way that you have just helped me out so much with learning how to be a reborn artist and giving me the courage to do what I have to do. And I really appreciate everything that you've done for me. And thank you for adopting me as your daughter. <laughs> I've, I've, it's always good to have lots of moms, you know. I, I've, I've got lots of moms, and I'm grateful for it. My grandmother's my second mom. You know, uh, my, my, some of my, you know, some of my friends, they're like moms to me. It's weird, but it's cool. <laughs> I like it because it's nice to have people that care about you. And I'm glad that I have friends and family there for me. I don't know what I'd do without them. They have my heart. They really do. And, um, yeah. Well, I guess that's about it. I mean, I have nothing else to say, but, um, I will do videos of all the items that I get when they come on Thursday or Friday, she said. Um, I also will do rooting um, videos when my mohair comes in for my Zinni doll. And I will also show you um, the halogen oven when it comes in. And that's about it. Alright. Take care and I hope you all have a safe and good day. And I'll be back. Bye.